Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen of the Intertubes, to iPlay, where I play a game, you watch, and we all get terrified of stuff, because, you know, it's amnesia. Oh boy. Okay, um, I'm trying to remember here. Completely and utterly terrified, because last time I ran into some dead people, much like him, except they were more alive and they were clawing at my face. Okay, so I think it might have set me back a little further ways than, uh, well, this might be a beneficial thing, because I remember seeing a sign for a kitchen. Alright, on. Storage. Kitchen. Let's go this way. Completely forgotten which way I went. Where I've been and everything else. Hello, creepy cockroach. I sure so hope he's not coming this way. That's way too soon. Come on, man, come on, please no. No, no, no. Too soon. Too soon, man. Sit here. Until you leave. Because you know. You're not supposed to be here. Okay. Oh. That's my entrance cave. Come on, over the rock. Try and be sneaky about this. Kitchen. Come on. Crouch up the stairs. Sneaky ninja. Hello? Okay, good. Good progress. 4th of August, 1839. The nightmares woke me in the early morning, and for a moment I forgot where I was. Shortly after, there was a knock on my door. Alexander had heard my screams and asked me to join him in the parlor. As we drank our tea, Alexander began to tell me what he knew. It seems like the orb I found casts a long and dark shadow. It's not only a powerful item, but a dangerous one. Simply by touching it, you invoke the powers within, and if you are too weak to control it, it will devour you. The shadow is a sluggish thing, lagging behind the wielder, killing anyone or anything in its path to reclaim the orb. I said I didn't care about its powers and that I should throw it away. Alexander advised against this, as I'd still be a part of the path to the orb, and eventually suffer death. Having the orb, oh, I would at least have the chance to fight back when the time came. I asked Alexander what he meant when he said he could protect me, and he answered that things can be done, but at a price. Well, I think I know the price of other people's existences. Murdering old people, other people. Throwing knives and stale bread. Surely there's gotta be something other in, in here than I. Ah, yeah, touch the fire, let's hurt myself, yeah. Fuck. More rotting pigs. 
Ow! Oh god, why did I touch it? Ow! And I just touched the fire. Bottom. Okay. Wound is bleeding quite badly. Well, I'll, I'll leave that wound to hopefully regenerate. Um. Yeah, what happened to my container? Didn't I? Okay, so I need acid. Need the acid. But where's the... I thought I had a container. Oh look, I can oh I can pick up and throw the baby pig corpse. This is disturbing. Oh, is there something in here? No? Okay. Um I have no idea what to do. Could I use that pot for something? No? Maybe? The metal wouldn't hold the acid for very long. Okay. Well, this is just great. It means I need to go find another container, doesn't it? Now I have Mr. Zombie Omble. Friendly neighborhood, well, not friendly, unfriendly neighborhood, undead shambling thing. Trying to murder me. Okay, so that's the one I've got to get the stuff on. Oh, jeez. Yes, I'm going to get in the habit of checking every corner similar like that, because it's frickin' terrifying. storage. Well, surely storage has a container that I can use. Okay. Okay, good. Tinder. Tinder. On Tinder. Glass jar. Fantastic. I know exactly where to go now. I have no reason to panic. Stay calm. Stay cool. Got everything I need. Okay. Oh, 
hello, Mr. Shambling Dude. Well, cripes. Okay, <clears throat> so, um, I have to go past you. This way. Screw it up running. I hope he just takes it upon himself to run around in circles forever. Because I want none of it. Whew. Okay, I'm safe. <clears throat> okay, maybe not. go. Oh jeez, he is angry. I'm not here. You can't see me. I'm not here. La 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 la. La 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 la. Happy place. Happy place. Not moving. I'm in a nice, happy place. Surrounded by rotting pigs. You can go away now. There's no one here. Seriously, dude. Go away. Nobody likes you. Gone. Okay. Good. Good. I'm glad I closed that door. Ugh. Careful now. Very sneaky. She dead. It would do no good. Is what? What do you mean it would do no good? Oh no. Oh, please tell me worse on this one. Cannot use the item this way. Well, how am I supposed to frickin'? would do no good. Where do I... what? Now that's not the right thing to go to. Mementos. The gate leading out of the area is locked by a worn padlock. Which... which gate? Is this not the right way to go? Oh, well that's not cool. It is filled with acid. Oh, cripes. Okay. Okay, so the kitchen's that way. I shouldn't need anything from there anymore.
Can my eyesight return to me? Please. Okay. So, trying to figure this out. Did I go this way? This is where I started. This is where I respawned after being murdered. Happy, happy murder. Okay. So... Guessing this is it? Let us try. Hey! Has severely weakened the padlock. Oh, crap. Ten sister. The servants avoided him, yet he knew they were there. They all smelled of spiced wine, a mystic scent permeated by clove and sage. Ah! Oh, thank goodness I'm in, a, I'm in another place. So you use the drain sewers as a means of transport? Yes, they were built to divert water from an underground spring and are quite spacious. It seemed only natural to incorporate it into the overall structure. But we won't be using it. Not today. The flow is seasonal, and when the spring runs dry, the damp tunnels produce a rather poisonous type of fungi. There is an antidote, of course, but we won't be bothering with it today. Come, this way instead. We're almost there. Fantastic. Fantastic. Fan... diddly -astic. I... I've, n I've no idea what I'm gonna do here. But the poisonous fungi does not sound quite as fun. Those to come down. I need to get to the ladder. Its gears need to be greased. Its gears need to be greased, eh? I have some oil. Did that really? No, I guess not. Guess I'll have to go that way. Do I even want to know what this is? Oh, that's oil. Oil drainage. Last jar of oil. Here we go. Oh, wants to be pipe. How does this magically control that ladder? Oh, come on. Third time's a charm. Oh, I gotta push it back up. And down. And I say down. There we go. And that leads over there. Well, you know what? I'm gonna call it a day. Because I was completely terrified in the darkness over there. Sorry for not having uploaded an episode last weekend in Cyber. Making this one a somewhat short one, but you know, all the same. I'm completely terrified of this game, so I'm reluctant. Thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen of the Intertubes. If you liked it, like it. If you would like it to leave a comment, by all means, leave a comment. 
see you all next weekend in our homes. Bye-bye.